uh, Michelangelo uh, monologue is about a guy he's painting you know art and he's talking about his past love he had there's two locations one in Florence and the one is Bologna so the one in Florence uh, he's talking directly to that person telling her that or him in this case but uh, we use the he a she we use a she for this case but uh, um, He's telling her that I don't love you anymore because there's no more room for me to love you. It's over. And then he goes to the past in Bologna and he talks about a woman, uh, a courtesan that he met up there and he totally felt in love with. And he wrote some sonnet for that woman and stuff. And then out of a sudden, she decides to break with him. And then he's very upset. So he says, like, even if I, even if I wrote those sonnets, they meant nothing to me. Because you know, the whole thing is that they divorced, they, they split, and he's upset, and she doesn't care, she's gone. And then he's, now he's, uh, he's um, after this uh, separation, he's wondering what's going on, so he starts to pray, to pray God. And then uh, he's starting also to be upset with God, because uh, uh, God gives always cripplizations to people. Uh, and then he was wondering if it was uh, something that um, uh, cri crippled him, me, the, 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 the artist, into a situation that he's alone. And uh, so he's, he refers to some example to what God cripples and helps an animal, let's say, to survive. And then for me to survive, to help me, he just says that I'm good in painting. And that's what I'm realizing. I'm just good in painting and, and creating myself. but. I cannot create with a person, I only can create through my art. So this is what I'm related to, arts, all those painting and frescoes that I'm doing. Um, so, so I brought uh, my paint shoes <laughs> and then my model light paper, of course. And then we have the brush that I'm gonna paint. No, I'm gonna, uh, what? Maybe take my sh your shoes off my couch. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So then we have brought the a brush so we can paint and I have my paint cloth that um, uh, Like the wardrobe, you know, this is going to be the paint cloth of the, the artist of me as Michelangelo and then uh, so we have the two painting there So we're gonna go see the painting and tell a story about those painting So uh, whenever you're ready, so we have this painting here. It's called uh, the storm at sea um, uh, the base color is all blue, so we have this, the, this, the land here and the water and then the storm, all the water going on down there and then the clouds reflecting the darkness in the sea. So we're going to talk about this one, this is going to be an example. And the second one here we're going to use is this one here. This one is fire at sea. So this is a sea and this is a big fire going on and, the, and higher up there is very dark with clouds and that's what reflects on the sea here so we're going to talk we're going to use those two as a painting sample uh, subject to talk about so maybe go and actually point at it you want me to say something say something oh no this you you already said it before this is oh. what you would put over what you just oh, did. Okay. Okay. So maybe just point to all the different things you talked about. All right, that's weird. Maybe do it. Maybe just go through and say all the stuff. Say again. something, yeah. yeah. Okay, go ahead. So that painting is uh, the storm at sea. This is the horizon of the sea here, and this is the sky. There's a storm, the clouds, the dark clouds reflecting on the sea. That's why it's dark here. So here this is the horizon where the sun is about and then it shows a little bit lights more onto the, the land. So the water, the storm is right there and then this is a sea as well. I maybe do that one now. This one right there. Yeah. So this, this one is fire at sea. So it's all red. So this is a sea here. This is the horizon of the sea and this is a cloud and this is a fire somewhere in the back. It's probably a city combined with a forest. So there's a fire goes going on and then the cloud is very dark and then everything is reflected on the sea as a very dark 
just in case you want to show you talking to someone. Oh, okay. It doesn't have to be, but um, where is the other painting? Oh, it's here. Yeah, okay. So we're going to use this first one. Okay. So that's enough. Yeah. As you want. And then I would like to do it, I, mean, uh, I will improv in French, translate that in French, so I can get the, the French market. Okay. <laughs> I don't have a script. It's the same script, but I will translate that in French in my mind. Got it. Yeah. So. Okay. Hey. What do you got there, buddy? Uh, some fresco for my monologue. I'm a painter on this monologue. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. The fire at sea. See, it's a big fire going on. It's not bad, eh? I like it. Very nice. nice. See, we see the storm here, the dark cloud, the ocean, the sand, and this is a shadow of the dark cloud into the water. All right. Well, how much are you selling them for? <clears throat> why? Why would somebody buy this painting? Tell us about it. <laughs> <laughs> Come back to here again, just still rolling. Look at the lens that just stand there. All right, now just turn around, now start walking away. What I would do is cut to the painting before you, and then cut to you before you walk away on this last one. Now let's just do some inserts the brush. Okay. Uh, so paint the blue one for like 10 seconds, all in this like general area, and then move over to this one, 10 seconds, all that general. Okay. okay. But I'm gonna start at your face and go down. Okay. All right, action. <laughs> is that it? Yeah, this is the same thing in French.